Hello there guys, and welcome to something a little bit different, as I said I would do. Now this is a game that I have been following since pretty much I very first heard about it, which was about a year ago now, when I first saw it. It is my number one wishlisted game on Steam, currently. Uh, this to me just looks amazing, and they've released some new and old gameplay footage. And I'm just going to go through it, see what it's about, hopefully enjoy it, because it just looks amazing, like I said. And um, so, yeah, this is called Ferocious. And this is what it says. In Ferocious, your adventure begins after a shipwreck in the Pacific Ocean, where you awaken on the shores of a deadly island. As one of the few survivors, you must navigate deadly encounters with prehistoric creatures and armed mercenaries. Uncover the dark truth hidden within this enigmatic landscape as you fight for survival, explore treacherous terrains, and unveil the secrets lurking within Ferocious. Timeless, lost world setting. So that's what it says. And now, let's have a look at the trailer. Following footage is a work in progress. Okay, already I'm hooked. Just straight away. Oh, there's a dino. That is one giant crab. Look at the setting, man. Oh boy. Look at the detail in that. I mean, who doesn't like a dinosaur game? Seriously. Oh, here we go. A little gunplay. Okay. Customizable. Gun mechanics. Nice. Dude, I'm so hyped for this game, I cannot tell you. Ooh, destructible? Yes, destructible environment. Maybe? Reload. Okay, so the splash mechanics. Look at that island, dude. That's insane. You're a big boy. Ooh, night time. We've got a different gun, looks like an M4 now, maybe? Look at it, man, it just looks so detailed. Looks insane. Video quality is not the best, but... Look at the lighting coming through the trees there. This must have taken some doing, man. That's all I can say. Oh. There she is. There's the prehistoric island. Lost to time. That just looks incredible. I am so rooting. Oh my god for this game. I really hope that this comes out soon. And I really hope that this is real. I mean, based on what we're seeing... Oh, hello. Yep. Based on what we're seeing... I, I have a strong belief that this is real. I don't believe this is another... Days gone fiasco. Here we go, we've got some more gunplay here. Okay, I can't tell yet if there's. It looks like recoil. Bandaging. Healing. I wonder if it's. It doesn't even say if it's multiplayer or single player, nothing. Literally, what I read out a minute ago was. We, oh my god! Project Ferocious. 
Okay, here's a little bit of the physics and the mechanics. Real-time glass breaking. This must have taken them so long to do. I mean, if this is real, and God, I hope it's real, I think this is going to be a massive hit. I think everybody likes a survival game. Everybody's played DayZ, everybody's played Scum, everybody's played Rust, Ark, all that kind of stuff. This is like Ark on steroids. Real-time wet sand mud effect. Look at that. Okay, and you can interact with your environment. Look at that, man. Old stick, that said. So you can... Okay, maybe there's crafting as well, then. Pick up a stick, maybe make a torch. I wonder if there's base building. I mean, you got to sleep somewhere, right? Although, <laughs> probably sleep in the trees if it were me. Okay, scopes. So there is definitely a little bit of recoil there, and it looks like hitting them headshots isn't going to be that easy. Not with that, anyway. Looks like a car 98. Here's a car 98. Okay, so this is the mercenaries they were talking about. Yep, there we go. Oh, it's all kicking off. Holy crap. Looks like you got... Take, it looks like you can take a few hits. I mean, th again, <laughs> this is work in progress. In the real thing, if we get it, it might be one hit, you're dead. Who knows? Okay, there's a little crafting bag. So you can craft bandage. Again. Very similar to the animation from Green Hell, that is. And also a little bit like um, the Far Cry games. But I think uh, the developer comes on at the end and he says that he's taken inspiration from Far Cry and those kind of things. The one thing that they can never get in games is water outside of the boat. But, honestly, that's the least of my worries. Look at this, man. This is insane. I am so... I just cannot wait for this game. I want it to come out now already. Mist, fog rolling through the valley. It's just so detailed. Ooh, okay. Pick up weapons. There's Mr. Shark again. Is that an AUG? No, that's a shotgun, sorry. Ew. What the, I can't remember what those things are called. They live in the caves and they're like scorpion spiders, but I can't remember their name of them. They're horrible looking things. Yeah, those things look. Ooh, they give you the creeps. Okay, stealth possibilities. How are you going to outrun a dinosaur? We're back here again. Okay, he got doinked. Blood splatter from the, those spider things. Whoa! Okay, so we do have a destructible environment, pretty much, by the looks of it. Yep, there you go, look at that tree. So we do have a destructible environment, which I think everybody appreciates in a game. It's about the, for me, it's always been about the realism. Always. Yeah, that's destructible. Okay, here's a little bit of in-game footage. Okay, that is a bit choppy with the frame rate, but again, work in progress. Swimming. Climbing? Oh, I'm assuming climbing, yes, ladder. Yeah, it's a little bit choppy, 
but again I'm sure optimization will come like it always does you know this is just pre 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 alpha this is and this if this is pre 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 alpha then oh my god sign me up where do I sign give me the dotted line did that just say that? The Agent 47. I'm sold. Take my money. I'm sold. Hey everyone. My oh. name is Leo and I'm the lead developer of a new action adventure game Ferocious. I began working on Ferocious a few years ago with the idea of creating a first person shooter in a timeless lost world type of setting, combining all the top action with exploration and a sense of wonder. Oh, that dude just got annihilated. We were always inspired by mysterious places frozen in time that you may have seen in movies like King Kong and Jurassic Park. We aim to marry the setting and unique gameplay opportunities with classic first-person shooter mechanics, similar to early installments of franchises like Far Cry and Crisis. The flexibility of the Unity engine allows us to create unique solutions to some of the environmental features, such as custom water effects and realistic vegetation. Oh, wow. Use a mix of photo scanned and handcrafted assets to create a world both scary and beautiful. Ew. However, there are some things waiting for you in the jungle that we couldn't find any reward references for. Soviet improvise. Look at that, dude. I hope you guys are excited as I am. Feel free to wishlist and follow the game on Steam. I am. Like I said, take my money, sign me up. I want it. I want it now. I want this now. Oh my god. I cannot tell you how hyped I am for this game. So yeah, that is ferocious. I hope you're as hyped for it as I am. No details when it's coming out, no nothing. But like I said, it's my number one listed game, wish listed game. And as soon as this drops, oh, as soon as this drops, you know full well I'll be getting this straight away. So leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. Is this your kind of game or not? <clears throat> Are you going to wish this list? Wish list this by saying that when you're drunk. But yeah, thanks very much. And as always, I'll catch you all on the next one.